What's up Guardians, welcome back and welcome to those new. I'm Arthur to Epiphany and I make Destiny 2 content for all Guardians. So in today's video we will be covering the seasonal weapon Doomed Petitioner and its PvE and PvP God Roll. So I know you're wondering Epiphany, how do you get your hands on this linear fusion rifle? Well the Doomed Petitioner can be acquired by completing the seasonal activities, Ribbon's Lair, the Coil, or by simply acquiring Season of the Wish engrams and turning them in at the seasonal vendor ribbon located at the helm. So first off we're going to go with the PvE god rule. So for the barrel we're going to be going with fluted barrel for that increase in stability and handling. For the battery we're either going to go with liquid coils for more overall damage or enhanced battery for an increase in mag size. For the third column you can go for a reconstruction so it will overflow the mag while it is stowed. Or we can go with Envious Assassin, which overfills the mag based on the amount of kills with other weapons, and while it is also stowed. For the fourth column, you can go for Precision Instrument, which procs when you do sustained damage, it increases precision damage. With this linear being an aggressive frame 3 round burst on the first linear shot, it will proc Precision Instrument instantly. Now you can go with surrounded but keep in mind that surrounded is a very situational perk if no enemies are close to you then the perk will not proc and you'll miss out on a lot of damage and for the pve god rule where the master work we're going with is range next we're going to get into the pvp god rule that you are looking for so for the barrel we're either going to go with arrow at break for that increase in recoil control or corkscrew rifling for that increase in range, stability, and handling. For the battery, we can go an enhanced battery for that increase in mag size or accelerated coils for that faster charge time by the cost of range. For the third column, we can go with keyboy for increase in reload, range, and accuracy, which is good because with a linear PvP, you want to play from a distance. For the fourth column, we're going to be going with moving target for increased movement speed and target acquisition when moving while aiming down sights. And same as the PvE God Roll Masterwork, we're going to go with range. My final thoughts on this linear fusion rifle that it is alright. Is it the greatest? No, but with precision instrument in reconstruction, it can be very nasty. I know Surrounded is the ultimate DPS perk, but it is definitely very situational. So with that said, there are definitely better options out there like Cataclysmic or Taipan if you are strictly looking for a void linear to use. I would say that you should still grind for it and give it a try for yourself because it still is a 3 round burst aggressive frame. That pretty much covers my full guide of everything you need to know about Doom's Partitioner and its god rolls. Thank you for watching, if you found this video to be helpful or useful in some way be sure to leave a like and if you enjoy my content consider subscribing to help support my channel. It's completely free and you would be helping this channel reach more amazing people like you that might have had the same questions you had. With all that being said, I'll catch you in the next one Guardians.